and Parliament is demanding the full disclosure of details of contracts independent power producers have signed with Kenya Power. This even as a task force appointed by President Uru Kenyatta to review power purchase agreements signed by the state power distributor continues with its work. Dennis Otieno reports. While appearing before the Public Investments Committee, the Kenya Power Management, led by Managing Director Bernard Ngugi, defended the rationale used in signing contracts with the independent power producers. If let will come as a windmill, change and has hydro. Why is hydro not telling you that our water is passing and energy is being produced and you still have to pay us whether you consume it or not? When you are coming to do an investment yourself, you must also ensure that there are returns on, that, on those projects. So the, hence the reason why you have capacity charges and also deemed energy. The committee reckons the current arrangement favors the producers more as they question the legal input in the process. Before you have this agreement signed, signed. there's always a government legal advisor and there's always an officer from the audit office. Do you have these particular uh, agreements deposited with you or have you ever seen some of these agreements? The AG is uh, not involved in the, in the, in the PPAs uh, in, in this way, but uh, there is a process of initiation of a, of a PPA up to the point of signing the PPA. But where um, the AG is involved is at the point of advising or giving a legal opinion on the letter of support. Since 2016, the government has made several attempts to renegotiate power purchase agreements with power producers. Such a review will affect operational as well as planned agreements. Kenya Power currently has 32 negotiated and approved agreements. Is this an international standard or way of doing things worldwide, especially on independent power producers? In late March this year, President Uru Kenyatta appointed a task force to review all power purchase agreements signed between the utility firm and power producers with a view of taming high energy costs. According to the committee, lowering fixed charges in energy contracts will not only offer financial relief to Kenya Power, but will also bring down power bills for consumers. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV.